On today's broadcast, we're exposing the truth behind America's food sensitivity crisis. America's number one gastroenterologist, Dr. Kenneth Fine, author of The Gluten Truth and founder of EntroLab in Dallas, Texas, reveals over a dozen foods that may be harming you and your family right now. Dr. Fine has been studying the effects of gluten and other food sensitivities for over 25 years. EntroLab was created to give you direct access to a valuable health tool the big food companies don't want you to know about. Why? Major food corporations have spent years altering our food supply so that you are getting more chemicals, toxins, GMOs, synthetic hormones, and free radicals in your food. This is why the foods you've eaten for years now trigger painful symptoms. It's estimated that approximately 75 million men and women have some kind of food sensitivity. Are your health problems caused by food? Coming up, discover a simple at-home stool test that pinpoints the specific foods attacking your immune system every day. Meet Dr. Fine's patients who've experienced life-changing results with his patented testing method. Join health reporter Annalisa Del Cane for the real story behind Dr. Fine's scientific research in digestive conditions, hidden food sensitivities, medical testing, and how you can transform your health in as little as two weeks. It all starts right now. Welcome to the program. I'm Annalisa, and I'm here with Dr. Kenneth Fine. We're talking about food sensitivities and the many issues that they can cause in the body. Dr. Fine, welcome. Thank you, it's great to be here, Anna. Dr. Fine, you're considered by many Americans to be the go-to gastroenterologist. You've been a specialist in the GI tract for almost 25 years and the founder of EntroLab, which has been around for almost 15 years. Well, that's right, Anna. When I started EntroLab, I wanted to create a way for the everyday person to get these tests conveniently and as inexpensively as possible. You're the doctor that doctors come to when they hit a wall with a patient. In fact, at EntroLab, about 70% of your lab tests are ordered by other doctors. Is this correct? Once doctors started learning about the test and what I was doing, they quickly became a majority of my clientele. Now, EntroLab is a accredited medical lab in Dallas, Texas, where you get dozens and dozens of lab tests requested every day for tests for those hidden food sensitivities. That's exactly right, Anna. We believe that our new tests can improve the health of millions of people worldwide. People suffering from colitis or chronic diarrhea or bloating, eczema, depression, infertility, some have autism, an inability to lose weight, ADD, ADHD, it's a long list, you name it. It is possible to see life-changing improvements, sometimes it, it, as quickly as within a week, sometimes as up to 90 days, but if you eliminate the right food that you're sensitive to, the, the proper uh, improvement comes. And to be blunt, what's happening is that people are ordering your mail-in test, providing a stool sample, freezing it overnight, and mailing it back in the next day for your lab to analyze. And it's like a crystal ball. You learn all of this information simply by doing that? It's not so much the crystal ball as it sounds like. I mean, after all, veterinarians have been sampling stool samples from our pets for decades and we never questioned that and so really it's just simple as looking inside your intestine from the stool sample itself. You're the only lab in the U.S. that does this type of testing. Exactly what are you discovering in the lab? Well from the tests that are mailed to us we've discovered that in addition to the high prevalence of gluten sensitivity many if not most people have an additional hidden food sensitivity as well. A large percent have autoimmune disease, many discover they have irritable bowel syndromes and others such disease diseases as colitis, Crohn's disease, and related syndromes. And for many, we're able to tell them which foods are causing their colitis, their chronic physical and mental fatigue, their weight loss, others with headaches, depression, even seizures and osteoporosis and neuropathy, and you've heard about autism related to these food sensitivities as well. Now, Anna, using this simple mail-in test, people discover that they have been potentially misdiagnosed and go through a majority of their lives on medications that cause everything from stomach ulcers to internal bleeding, stroke, even suicidal thoughts from antidepressants, and all because their symptoms were misdiagnosed and all they really had to do was cut out one or two foods from their diet. When I started the lab 14 years ago, I wanted people to be able to take charge of their own health, so I made these tests very informative and very affordable. I found Interolab and Dr. Fine's work, and I ordered the test, and three weeks later, the test uh, showed that I was intolerant to gluten, dairy, soy, and egg. 
I couldn't believe after eliminating gluten for the first month that my stomach problem, the pain that I had always had all my life, just disappeared. Today, living a, a lot healthier life, just being able to be diagnosed with having an intolerance to gluten, dairy, soy, and egg. I feel extremely grateful because I have a life back again and I can spend it with my sons and with my new daughter-in-law and my husband without um, feeling sick all the time. I would definitely recommend this product to any other patient. It has severely changed the way I think. I'm able to concentrate. I don't have the stomach issues. I'm able to do anything just by watching what I eat. And it was a very simple test, just one doctor. It's very simple, easy to do regardless of age, and it can help you tremendously. Well, nowadays we know that everyone could be gluten sensitive at any point in time. Those genes lie, lie dormant until there's a trigger and uh, there's a catalyst of some kind that triggers those genes and all of a sudden we, you can't eat a lot of the foods that contain gluten that you used to be able to enjoy. It's a fact. Food sensitivities are ruining the health of millions of men, women, and children. Fact. You may be suffering from a hidden food sensitivity making you feel sick and tired while destroying your immune system. Fact. Entrolab is the only accredited medical lab in the U.S. offering this patented stool testing kit that will reveal exactly which foods are causing your health issues. So I pinpointed one thing in the test results and with and I removed uh, the casein from my diet and uh, within days uh, my hives went away. I was shocked with the eggs mm -hmm. and then recently finding out with the flu shot and they're based with the eggs. It makes sense there. Getting your Entrolab stool testing kit is easy. Step one, order your kit today and we'll help you determine the right level of testing for you and your family. Step two, collect, freeze, and mail your sample with our easy to use at home kit. Step three, receive your results electronically and confidentially. Within two weeks, we knew exactly what we needed to eliminate from our diets. She's healthier for it. I'm healthier for it, and we're both happy. So when I took the test, it was pretty easy. Um, I pooped in it, put it in the freezer, in the container, and sent it off the next day. It's pretty much a no-brainer, user-friendly for everyone. If you've tried testing for food sensitivities before and have been disappointed, the Entrolab mail-in test will work for you. If you're frustrated because you've already made diet changes but still have persistent health issues, Dr. Fine's test gives you a clear answer. Entrolab testing is the most accurate way to prove your family's risk level to gluten, eggs, milk, soy, nuts. More than 14 food sensitivities can be detected from just the one sample you mail in. Call today and order your Entrolab test plus receive Dr. Fine's health conference CD, The Gluten Truth, free. Get the facts you need to get the health benefits you deserve. The gluten and the wheat and the grains have been hybridized enough and the genes modified accordingly that we are seeing a different set of genes in the plant and I believe that is part of the reason why we're seeing so much gluten sensitivity today as opposed to the past. Welcome back. I'm Annalisa and I'm here with Dr. Kenneth Fine who's considered America's number one gastroenterologist. This really is a comprehensive medical test that you can take just by calling the number at the bottom of the screen. It costs less than most doctor visits and other lab tests even with medical insurance. And that's correct, Anna. Uh, Enterolab has developed a proprietary and patented screening test for gluten sensitivity, as well as many other antigenic food sensitivities. It's more insightful, it's more sensitive than other tests used in current practice. Now remember, our method utilizes stool rather than blood mm -hmm. as the testing substrate. The rationale, of course, is that stool rather than blood is where your food is and that your immune system inside your intestine is the place where it reacts to proteins in the diet, just as if they were infectious organisms entering the diet. Can you briefly talk with us about some stories that really stand out in your mind? You know, there's one I want to mention, and that's infertility. Infertility really hits people at their heart because, you know, Sure. couple wants to have a, a child, they want to be parents, and they can't get pregnant. Of course, the stress of that just makes it worse. And gluten sensitivity impairs fertility in both women and in men. Oh, wow. And I actually have a colleague who 
consulted me and asked me, could, could gluten be the cause of, of my infertility? And I said, that is actually been reported. He, and he did my test. He was positive, he went on a gluten-free diet. And he, today, baby Miles is evidence that this is a real true story. Aww. And he doesn't mind me, I haven't said his name, but he doesn't <laughs> mind me telling the story because he always says, I'll be your poster boy Aww, for this. So. That's a wonderful story. Thank you yeah. so much for sharing that. I got very, very ill. My liver shut down, my kidney shut down, extreme pain, weight loss, diarrhea. When I was diagnosed three months later with celiac disease, I realized it is genetic. My entire family, my two children, my parents, even my husband, it just opened up a whole bunch of information about my entire family. I started out with my children. My son came out with gluten sensitivity. My daughter quit gluten when I quit gluten. But we went on to soy and dairy and she came up positive. Doctors are saying there's no test for gluten sensitivity, so just quit eating gluten and see how you feel. There is a test for it. I tested because I was experiencing bloatedness and gaseousness and constipation. Then I finally decided to test, and when I did, I found out that I was both gluten and casein intolerant. I do not now have the constipation issues that I had before. Also, my neurological issues that I was having with the cramping in my feet has ultimately subsided. Brain fog has gotten so much better. I have really benefited from taking those things out of my diet. At the time that I was developing these tests, I started to eat healthier and I thought eating oatmeal and granola and, and shredded wheat was the way to do that. And I was getting severe abdominal pain every morning about 10 o'clock, gas and and other you know, abdominal symptoms, but I've also had a lifelong lower back sacroiliac problem that I also thought might be related to gluten sensitivity. So at, a, at an early time in the research, I took a test myself, found out I was gluten sensitive, and I started on the course of gluten-free diet and other diet elimination. And what I found out was that a gluten-free diet alone helped my intestinal symptoms, which is very common, but it really didn't help my, my arthritis so much. In fact, replacing the wheat with other grains like corn and rice were, were giving me new symptoms. Mm. And so I eliminated these foods and suddenly the, the arthritis that was keeping me from being able to sit at all uh, and be active and be healthy, and I was only about 30 years old at the time, suddenly I was pain-free. I was able to get off all of the non medicines which were bothering my stomach and esophagus anyway. Wow, that is all so very interesting, Dr. Fine. I felt lethargic um, and I feel like I'm too young to feel this way. I had exhausted so many different ways of eliminating things, going to an acupuncturist, doing Chinese herbs, um, going to a naturopath, um, all of those and having high colonics, you name it, I've tried it. I was frustrated that I'm still having certain issues. I wasn't surprised overly about the results other than the fact that some of the levels were high even though I had already taken these things out of my life for a couple years to three years. And it made me wonder what have I been eating that might possibly have gluten in? And then to see the result that eggs were an additional thing to have to think about because the results actually showed that I was high considering the lack of gluten I have in my life. This testing really just helps you basically to cut to the chase. This is going to involve hundreds of millions of people. It doesn't seem that the hospital I was at was interested to, to carry the technology further. And I kind of had this, what I call a spiritual tap on the shoulder, <laughs> as if, you know, my calling had to now turn to doing this publicly and becoming a public health educator. And how about all of the other foods like corn and barley and even some people have been noted to be allergic to certain fruits and through all of this, you're going to get that information just from that simple stool sample, right? Well, that's right, Anna. Wow, that is all so very interesting, Dr. Fine.
It's a fact. Food sensitivities are ruining the health of millions of men, women, and children. Fact. You may be suffering from a hidden food sensitivity making you feel sick and tired while destroying your immune system. Fact. Entrolab is the only accredited medical lab in the U.S. offering this patented stool testing kit that will reveal exactly which foods are causing your health issues. I was shocked with the eggs. Mm -hmm. And then recently finding out with the flu shot, and they're based with the eggs. It makes sense there. Dr. Fine has been studying the effects of gluten and other food sensitivities for over 25 years. Entrolab was created to give you direct access to a valuable health tool the big food companies don't want you to know about. Why? Major food corporations have spent years altering our food supply so that you are getting more chemicals, toxins, GMOs, synthetic hormones, and free radicals in your food. This is why the foods you've eaten for years now trigger pain symptoms with just a single bite. But do you know the exact foods your body is rejecting? So I pinpointed one thing in the test results and with and I removed uh, the casein from my diet and uh, within days uh, my hives went away. Getting your Entrolab stool testing kit is easy. Step one, order your kit today and we'll help you determine the right level of testing for you and your family. Step two, collect, freeze, and mail your sample with our easy to use at home kit. Step three, receive your results electronically and confidentially. When I heard about Dr. Fine's test, I knew I had to get it. My wife has been suffering from different intestinal problems, and at this point, we just needed to get some answers. I ordered it. I actually ordered it for both of us. It came to the house. It was a simple test to take. Within two weeks, we knew exactly what we needed to eliminate from our diets. She's healthier for it, I'm healthier for it, and we're both happy. So when I took the test, it was pretty easy. Um, I pooped in it, put it in the freezer, in the container, and sent it off the next day. It's pretty much a no-brainer, user-friendly for everyone. Endrolab has developed a proprietary, patented screening test for gluten sensitivity, as well as many other antigenic food sensitivities. It's more insightful, it's more sensitive than other tests used in current practice. If you've tried testing for food sensitivities before and have been disappointed, the Endrolab mail-in test will work for you. If you're frustrated because you've already made diet changes but still have persistent health issues, Dr. Fine's test gives you a clear your answer. Entrolab testing is the most accurate way to prove your family's risk level to gluten, eggs, milk, soy, nuts. More than 14 food sensitivities can be detected from just the one sample you mail in. Call today and order your Entrolab test, plus receive Dr. Fine's health conference CD, The Gluten Truth, free. Get the facts you need to get the health benefits you deserve. Gluten sensitivity means that your immune system recognizes gluten as an invading organism almost, that it's something that the immune system has to fight and neutralize, usually first inside the intestine. The majority of people who have gluten sensitivity don't know they have it because they may just have the immune response going on inside the intestine for years before they get damage and the only time you get symptoms from any disease is when enough tissue has been affected or you have enough uh, organs multiple organs involved that you either get a syndrome or some symptoms Welcome back to the program. I'm Annalisa and I'm here with Dr. Kenneth Fine, America's number one gastroenterologist and the founder of Enterolab. Dr. Fine, today you had a chance to consult with some people who have taken your at-home stool test kit. I want to play some clips of what they've discovered and of your one-on-one -on -one consultation with them. Hi, Karen. Thanks for coming today. We're going to talk about the testing that you did with my lab, Entrolab. And uh, the first question I'd like to ask you is, what symptoms led you to take the test? I had a lot of stomach bloating, brain fog, a lot of uh, sinus infections. I took uh, antibiotics repeatedly. When I eat certain foods, I get hives um, around my um, chin, my neck, on my upper back mm -hmm. um, that are very uncomfortable. Did you do any food sensitivity testing at that time? I have done food sensitivity testing multiple times in probably the last 20 years. Yeah, and has it, has it been helpful? Uh, no. 
Okay, and how has it not been helpful? Because because I test negative oh. to dairy, um, soy. I test negative to foods. Yeah. So you have an it. In inclination from your experience that you know what the problem is and then you go get a test and it shows up negative. Well, that's actually kind of the cornerstone of why our stool testing is so much more sensitive than other forms of testing because the intestine don't lie is really what it boils down to. So when I read my results that casein, um, you know, can, it can be causing my sensitivity, uh, my hives, I went back and looked at the label. <laughs> the ingredients. Right. You thought it was the soy of the cheese. Right. It was the casein additive. Right. You removed the casein, and within two weeks you had no symptoms? Right, within a few days I had my symptoms improved. So over the last 15 years, I feel like I have fumbled around trying to figure out what, on my own, what, um, sensitivities I have, and I feel like your test has really pinpointed that quickly. Kim, yes. tell me the symptoms that led you to do the Enterolab test. Yeah. I felt bloating, abdominal discomfort, cramps, and constipation. Yeah, so that's yep. actually the irritable bowel syndrome, okay. practically all of the symptoms. Have you had that a long time in your life? For the past decade. Yeah, mm -hmm. okay. And um, had you ever suspected that there might be any food sensitivity issues related to that at all? Actually not, I attribute it to hormonal changes. Uh -huh. Your syndrome, as you just described, would be irritable bowel syndrome requiring either a gluten-free diet alone, but oftentimes dairy sensitivity goes along with gluten with the irritable bowel syndrome. And sure enough, that's exactly what your results showed. Okay. With the symptoms that you have with mm -hmm. the bloating, with the pain, have you started your d dietary intervention at this point? I have. Yeah. Okay, so Peter, let's sure. talk to you. Um, what were your symptoms that led you to do the test? Very gassy, very bloated. Yeah. Uh, have um, you had a flu vaccine by any chance? I have, yes. So your results actually are not rare, we would say. Okay. You did show a sensitivity to gluten, mm -hmm. but you showed a sensitivity much higher to egg. Which surprised me, because I, like and, I said, I And have... I'm suspecting that the, the flu vaccines might be part of this, because they're yeah. using egg protein as part of the, they are, the yeah. medium of, of vaccinating people, which, is, something, which yeah. is an immune stimulation, because I've, I've, I've only seen it in recent years. We didn't see it, you know, 15 yeah. years ago when we started. Yeah, because usually it's, it's the cheeses, the dairy that yeah, affects me mo more. And yeah. I've never really had an issue with eggs. Yeah. Have you been able to change your diet based on your results yet? I fought it. Yeah. But I have a persistent partner here, and she says, come on, let's just try, try it. it. Let's just see what it does. And it is good to do it together. And, and, and it's better yeah, for us. Yeah, because when we're cooking together. Health. And I've, I've actually, don't want to tell you this, but I have seen a positive change. Yeah. Uh, and, and that and, and has made a difference. Dr. Fine, some of those people were able to find out more from this simple at-home stool test of yours than they could from their own doctor. And you know, I wish I could say I made up the, the concept that if you have gluten sensitivity, you can have other food sensitivity. This research goes back to the 1960s. It started with milk and eggs, it being associated with, gluten, with, with the gluten sensitivity of celiac disease. Mm -hmm. And so even from the start, as soon as we started enter a lab, we started offering a test for milk sensitivity, egg sensitivity, and a yeast that's associated with Crohn's disease called Saccharomyces cerevisiae. But at the same time, we started research in 2000, knowing that there, was, there were probably other food sensitivities that we were gonna be uncovering that we could then offer in a larger panel of tests. Wow, doctor, this is quite a wake up call for so many people out there today. From the tests that are mailed into us, we've discovered that in addition to the high prevalence of gluten sensitivity, many if not most people have an additional hidden food sensitivity as well. Now a large percent have autoimmune disease, many discover they have irritable bowel syndrome, others are able to confirm a family history of celiac disease from our gene testing. When I started Enterolab 14 years ago, I wanted people to be able to take charge of their own health, so I made these tests very informative and very affordable.
So Dr. Fine, I know with myself when I eliminated certain foods, my energy went up, I no longer had joint pain. What can other people expect when they eliminate certain foods like dairy and gluten? People feel better in ways that they didn't even know when they were impaired. So true. They feel psychologically better, they start sleeping better, their mood is better, their brain fog that they yes. didn't know they had. And even we've even heard stories like, well, I thought having eight bowel movements a day was normal. I didn't, or liquid oh, stool. No. I didn't know, I've had it my whole life. I didn't know it was abnormal. So we hear these stories that in addition to the symptoms that they identified as symptoms, that other symptoms improve. And that's actually been shown in celiac research as well, especially related to psychological well being and overall emotional well being. That's all the time we have today, folks. If you're interested in finding out what foods you may be sensitive to and how to make a change in your health for the better, those details are coming right up. Thanks for joining us today. So I pinpointed one thing in the test results and, with, and I removed uh, the casein from my diet. And uh, within days, uh, my hives went away. I ordered the test and three weeks later, the test uh, showed that I was intolerant to gluten, dairy, soy, and egg. I couldn't believe after eliminating gluten for the first month that my stomach problem, the pain that I had always had all my life, just disappeared. Today, living a, a lot healthier life, just being able to be diagnosed with having an intolerance to gluten, dairy, soy, and egg. I feel extremely grateful because I have a life back again and I can spend it with my sons and with my new daughter-in-law and my husband without um, feeling sick all the time. I would definitely recommend this product to any other patient. It has severely changed the way I think. I'm able to concentrate. I don't have the stomach issues. I'm able to do anything just by watching what I eat. And it was a very simple test, just one doctor. When I heard about Dr. Fine's test, I knew I had to get it. My wife has been suffering from different intestinal problems, and at this point, we just needed to get some answers. I ordered it. I actually ordered it for both of us. It came to the house. It was a simple test to take. Within two weeks, we knew exactly what we needed to eliminate from our diets. She's healthier for it. I'm healthier for it, and we're both happy. So when I took the test, it was pretty easy. Um, I pooped in it, put it in the freezer, in the container, and send it off the next day. It's pretty much a no-brainer, user-friendly for everyone. Uh, Endurolab has developed a proprietary and patented screening test for gluten sensitivity, as well as many other antigenic food sensitivities. It's more insightful, it's more sensitive than other tests used in current practice. If you've tried testing for food sensitivities before and have been disappointed, the Endrolab mail-in test will work for you. If you're frustrated because you've already made diet changes but still have persistent health issues, Dr. Fine's test gives you a clear Clear answer. Entrolab testing is the most accurate way to prove your family's risk level to gluten, eggs, milk, soy, nuts. More than 14 food sensitivities can be detected from just the one sample you mail in. Call today and order your Entrolab test, plus receive Dr. Fine's Health Conference CD, The Gluten Truth, free. Get the facts you need to get the health benefits you deserve.